All right, so for your final project, you're going to be recording the movie trailer project. For the movie trailer, you're going to go ahead and choose one of these four movie trailers. If you go and play it, if it doesn't work, you have to sign into YouTube. But when you play these videos, you will notice there's no sound. That's because I took the sound out and I want you to make the sound. Once you decide which one you want, you can hit the little pop out. And once it pops up, now you got your download button. You're going to download this to your piano folder. Once you download it to your piano folder, you are then going to go into Mixcraft 7. You're going to open up Mixcraft. You're going to go through the settings. Up top, you're going to select video. And then you're going to add video file. Once you add the video file, it'll pop up. And then you're going to make the music for it. Now, the reason I talk about the music as being something that is not just one song, because as you're watching these, different parts of the movie trailer are going to have different parts of the sound. They don't play the same sound throughout the entire movie. So if we just play this, in the beginning, when it kind of shows things off, you're going to have a certain type of sound with this. It's up to you, whatever you want. But as you go throughout your track, you're going to want to hear different types of music. There's obviously a loving type of stuff. All right. Later on, we're going to have the point where he's, well, that one again, he's fallen in love. But eventually he starts to notice other people. Things happen. Here's definitely an adventure, which is going to sound different later on. Each one of these different settings should have a different type of sound. That is going to sound different than the beginning. This here scene is going to sound different. So essentially, think of it as having a whole bunch of different mini songs. I said three to four mini songs. It may be more, maybe less. But you're going to have like mini songs that fit in the trailer. You won't necessarily have beginning and ends to each one. They just change according to what is happening on the screen. By the time you're done, you're going to go ahead and save your project. Once you save your project, since it now has a video, just like before, you're going to have to download it as an MP3 if it's just sound, MP4 if it's just video. Well, you have video and sound. So we want the MP4, and inside Mixcraft 7, it's called a WMV. Give it a new name and save it as a WMV. At that point, you are completely done with all of your projects. When you're done with your projects, you may go ahead and work on homework. You may study, you may read. While doing that stuff, you may listen to music on the computer. If you need to use your Chromebook, you let me know and you put your Chromebook up on the desk because people in the past have just decided to play video games. We're not playing video games. You're not able to play games. You're able to read, study, do homework. You put it up on the computer so that everybody can see if you're playing games, including me. All right, that is your final project.